is sponsored by Dignity Health Central Coast. More than one-third of Americans are now considered obese, but weight loss surgery is helping change lives every day. Dr. Julieta Chang with the Weight Loss Surgery Institute of the Central Coast explains. Patients who qualify for bariatric surgery are those who have a BMI or a body mass index of greater than 40, or patients who have a BMI between 35 and 40 with a weight-related comorbid condition. And those diseases include things like high blood pressure, type 2 diabetes, obstructive sleep apnea. A popular form of bariatric surgery is known as a sleeve guest we remove the majority of the stomach around 70 to 80 percent, leaving a thin banana-shaped stomach so patients feel fuller faster. The portion of the stomach that's removed also makes hunger hormones, and so patients don't feel as hungry after the procedure, which also helps them to lose weight. After this procedure, we generally tell patients to expect to lose around 20 to 25 percent of their total starting weight. We now perform these surgeries laparoscopically, usually with five little incisions, the biggest ones less than an inch long, and the rest of them are about the width of my pinky finger. Most patients stay about one or two nights in the hospital and they're able to go back to work after about two weeks and so much quicker recovery. After weight loss surgery, there's a decreased risk of developing heart attacks and the reason for that is surgery decreases high blood pressure and also high cholesterol. And overall, weight loss surgery actually increases lifespan. For more information, visit DignityHealth.org slash Central Coast. I'm Kristen Priesel. Health Break is sponsored by Dignity Health Central Coast.